Hi yeah, boys and girls, this is like Ken still welcome back to a, a new video and today we I will show you guys why this uh, Mega Boost uh, Club Arena is one of the best Mega Boosts uh, aka Club Arena for you to uh, get XP really fast and yeah let's hop right into it. So our first opponent is Game Boy HI13 or Game Boy High 13. And yeah, let's go. I will actually go for this strategy because this is probably one of the fastest and best strategies in the game. I would probably change the power into the um, what's it called into the uh, tier three from the farm power, eco power. So I think that would also help me a lot. But since this is not speed ba uh, balance, uh, maybe boost, I will actually go and with the lightning because lightning will also save us some lives. If he has sorted runes, that's fine by me, I will just wait and see. But it doesn't seem like it, so I will actually go and send some balloons at him at the same time, and also I will probably go and get my second farm right away. I will probably set my lightning right here at the end. He's also going lightning, that's fine by me. I will gladly use my lightning as well. And I think when I got my 1-0 I will go for my uh, Mega Boost right here and I will also get the Plantation right here. Perfect. Now that we got it I will actually set my Ace uh, Ice right here, get a Snap Freeze and then we should be also fine. There we go. He has an uh, Ninja, that's perfect by me. I can actually go and get my uh, Farm right here, that's also perfect. I can leak, I can actually tank those lives, I don't actually care. So let's go. Once you got this plantation, once again, you will go for a tower boost once again, aka tower mega boost. Just leak the ta uh, just leak the tanks here. Tank the leaks, thank you. I cannot speak English anymore. But it's not a surprise thing. Now you can also lightning it once again for the last time. Get a uh, plantation and then go for a tower mega boost. Now that you got it, go for your last uh, farm right here. Also start getting some Corpras after this. And I think you are already beautiful done it and I think after this you can easily get this. So I think when we got our fourth plantation, aka Republic, I will go for my Corpora. And then I will also show you guys how to be defeat the Corpora players once you see them in the arena. So let's go. This is our last uh, tower mega boost. Pretty nice. And then we, saw we will also go for a 4-2 factory spam here. We should also be fine because this also has the camo detection so that's actually beautiful and fine at the same time. I will go for uh, two more of those 4-2. And then we should also spam the Cobras because Cobras OP. Since he has no money whatsoever, he's not even tower boosting, uh, tower mega boosting at all. I will go and get this here. Trust me, this is still one of the best uh, club arena or club mode which exists still in this game for XP. But we need this on high arena, obviously. Sadly, NK does not do it, which is kind of sad. But yeah, this is actually the sad part. As you can see, round 10 already, one more came true. When I mega boosted, that's actually pretty insane. And yeah, let's go and see who's our last and who's our last tower combination as well. I guess power side. Uh, against but not so quit, so let's go and see if I can actually pull it off this time. I will go with a improved TK boost. And then I will go for this strategy here. This strategy is one of the best strategies against Corpus. If that's the case, that he's gonna rush us. So obviously you will obviously start with a ice tower right here and also anti-stall because anti-stalling is way better than you think it is. He's also anti-stalling so way better and easier at the same time. So let's go, let's see if I can still catch this up. Nope, I cannot, that's fine. Since you got this you can also just chill a bit and uh, start echoing. This is all you have to do and I think this player will also eco, yep it is, nice, nice, that's beautiful. Round 3, Round 7 and Round 9 is the way to go for the improved ticket boost on this uh, Mega Boost. So be uh, prepared 
to use it when I said it 3, 7 and 9 why did I say 7 and uh, 3, 7, 9 instead of 3, 5, A at 7? it's because 5 is a short round and short rounds are actually pretty bad and yeah I figured it out because that's a bad idea to use it he goes for a tier, f uh, tier 1 uh, 1 1 bow that, but it's actually pretty good he goes for 2 uh, 0 1 bow with 1 1 bow uh, between it so that's actually pretty good that's beautiful I will actually get this uh, combo pretty nicely done all you have to do is just to get a improved eco boost or a rather a super eco boost which is also pretty good so I think this strategy will also help you guys in the future in speed balance uh, or speed mega boost if that's the case when it comes out in BP Colosseum once again which hopefully will be coming out soon because I want to make some videos out of it how to defeat this strategy, uh, how to defeat these strategies or wherever against Kaukras and everything I will get this uh, treat 1 actually there we go no more will be struggling round 7 we got it 550 that's beautiful I will go and rush him with some Seafrost now there we go Seafrost I think 5 sets is beautiful. beautiful this will actually help me get a lot of eco and money at the same time he's tower boosting that's beautiful for me because he's going for a destroyer instantly and I think if he's gonna rush me with some Evites I will just tower boost and we are pretty chill against this and round 7 already done that's beautiful this is how you defeat those people easily if they go for a um, Cobra strategy that is I will wait to see if I can actually get the round 9 beautiful right come on please round 9 coming out thank you let's go with I think 820 eco is one of the best eco so far on round 9 so I think this is actually beautiful and I will start sending some leads to uh, make him leak and I think this is actually beautiful. I will go and rush him with some whites soon. Unless he's gonna rush me with whites himself. So I think this is actually beautiful. I will not use my uh, blue mega boost this time. Because that would be a waste. I mean it would be Seafrost and rainbows. But I think this is actually pretty useful here. Unless he goes for aircraft here. Which is doesn't, doesn't seem like it. He's actually handling it pretty easily. That's actually pretty nice. Since we got this ice tower now, it also attacks the camos, which is pretty good. So we can actually uh, save up some money at the same time if he rushes us. So I think we should be fine at this around. If that was speed, you should be easily getting like 1500 eco already. Because run ones uh, reds are pretty OP at the same time. Because early uh, eco is also pretty good. So I think with I think 1,500 eco should be beautiful. 1,500 eco on round 18 is one of the best so far, but I think with this strategy, this is one of the best because Corpus are still one of the hardest towers to defeat. If a good player like Six Sack Power uses it or Asian Sensation uses it. Vortrix, I don't know about him because I don't, I don't ever actually see him use Cobra that much. I mean, he came back and he has a bad situation right now, which also concludes that he has the COVID-19. This is very sad moment for this boy named Vortrix. Obviously, I hope for the best that he's gonna recover this soon as possible. This is all I want to say because uh, COVID-19 is not something you can actually laugh about. Same goes for the influenza. If someone has influenza or had someone like my mother, you probably wouldn't uh, actually like this. So once again, please do not make fun of uh, people that has corona. This won't actually not make me happy. Again, once again, uh, like in all my videos I said it before, please consider subscribing, liking to this video, aka to this channel. This makes my day pretty well and also makes me happy at the same time because uh, the videos I make is actually pretty hard to make since it is very affordable and I also sweat all the time. I also record in the night and also edit in the night if I got time to make you people happy at the same time but 
I don't seem like to be appreciated enough. So once again, if you think this should be appreciable, just uh, comment down or subscribe. This would have actually help me and also reach me to the comment in comment comment yes to the uh, new goal that I reached uh, to want to reach. This is actually 5k. 5k to this year since uh, thanks shout out to the Asian thing I guess I got a lot of subscription already 519 up subscribers already this is actually beautiful and I think I can actually reach 1000 actually in this next month if I keep doing my real job which is actually pretty nice and he's still not rushing me which is kind of sad because I want to rush him but at the same time if he rushes me I would also be rushed and I need eco so I think we treat Dao sneakers really good. Then after this I will start some pings. And after the pings I will actually send one BFB into or even two BFBs into TCMGs. So I can actually handle the round twenty-two. Uh yeah. So round twenty-two. Two CMGs for him. And there we go. There's also some more ups. This is kinda troublesome for him, but I think with this aircraft here he should be fine. 100% if not I think he's dead he's actually uh, tower mega boosting or rather bloom mega boosting but it seems like he is dead to AI mobs since he I think uh, DC glitched me once again like those players are mad actually he did defend it so I think he's actually pretty fine he is trying to survive and he's also trying to defend hope for the best that he's gonna win but I think Bolea will actually take it down and I think Bolea will actually lose to the CMG rush that I sent. I think so and I think this is also the GG to us and Bolea will be taken down soon enough. The road spike will not help you guys. Trust me those 20 life leaks will not help you. And I think yeah if he had 3 or 5 cannon chips and he was prepared he would actually defeat the CMG rush pretty easily. And also, sorry guys, but if you want to greet out, just get this already. As you can see, I only use my ice tower because he didn't rush me at all. But as you know, ice and ninja can double slow down and the super monkey can be the clear up and everything you want. So yeah, once again, thank you guys for watching. Uh, remember to subscribe, uh, subscribe and like the video if you want more. I know I'm a bit uh, struggling with the... Uh, saying stuff but it is what it is because I'm still sick I am staying at home all day aka all week now and yeah once again thank you guys for watching I'll make sure that I will continue my uh, Rex to powers as soon as possible because I want to get my next goal which is obviously I think super bloom boost or rather the um, super eco boost which is also pretty a long way to go but for first I want to go for the ooh, dual EK boost so let's go and see who will our first opponent in the next episode of Rex to Powers once again thank you guys for watching I'll see you guys in the next video and yeah peace